Hi guys, welcome to Sanfolio. Thank you for tuning in. Today we are reviewing a brand new entry, well, latest entry, I would say, from the house of Latafa, and this one is called Jasur. I got this like a week ago. I have been doing a back-to-back -back wearings for this guy just to, you know, get the feel of it. And this is pretty enjoyable, and let's talk about this. Let's go. All right, excellent presentation. Um, pretty unique box. I loved the presentation on this guy. This is dope in terms of when it comes to presentation. Absolutely 10 on 10 matte finish box here with uh, the couple of slogans here. Outrageous, hope, uh, victory, adventure, and like fearless, uh, you know, couple of trust, couple of, um, uh, slogans and you know and then and then it's all different on the different sides so we're here you're gonna see something else like bold brave fearless destiny and stuff like that pretty cool yeah we got the hologram stamp there this is just sore and majority of the details we've got is is right on the bottom of this uh this bottle and then uh we've got similar latafa logo dope matte dark um uh, dark black like matte finish pretty cool nice premium stuff let's off a logo here on top and the way it pops out it's like a double shielded covering right there so you got you know you got a, like a second layer of uh, security right there so this is again Jasur and then finally you pop this guy up and here we are with the with again all these slogans with all this gold beautiful crafted this is this is art this is proper craft like good stuff nice shiny all it's like plastic um but yeah good well printed well designed well carved good stuff i mean i can show you and rotate this all day long <laughs> pops out from this podium just like that and here is Jasur from Latafa and this part like the majority of the bottle is, is is the cap pops out that and this is this guy here right in the right from inside and this is the juice here well the juice is all the way up to up until here obviously this is a hundred mil um, but obviously most majority of the bottles are covered with that black plastic sheet uh, like covering and or a design whatever you call it just to make this nice cap snaps in but obviously uh, it's not one of those tough hefty ones it is plastic in the end of the day uh, but nice glass bottle here overall like that's that's premium so good class quality um, I was pretty impressed with the with the packaging for sure, as you can say, as you can see. But when it came to the juice, because obviously that's the most that matters, I was I was impressed. And uh, so yeah, let's talk about this. Let's start this off by giving it a, a spray just to refresh my memory here. <clears throat> I guess the mature audience will actually get to the notes and get get to the to the depth of it. That's uh, that's the category which they're gonna enjoy the most. Although young ones are absolutely gonna rock this too because it's right there in the middle for catering both like both the audiences. It opens up fruity, creamy, a bit powdery, very aromatic sweet date night romantic it's a good occasional and social scent if you know what i mean good for gatherings good for people friends night out date nights partying clubbing nice amount of good amount of vanilla here good amount of fruity notes good creaminess I can't really search the notes. Um, if you guys can, please let me know. Let me know for Jasur. I don't think it's been out yet. 
or put out in a way that it's easily like you know accessible um but yeah this guy is still available at a couple of uh discounters and i got this from frag bar and the good thing is they have the tester over there so if you're in toronto or gta so you can actually go and test it right there and i loved it when i tested it and i was like well obviously when you you, you know you're in a in a in a in a, in a perfume house you're you're testing a couple of stuff in that kind of a situation when you pick this up out of 10 12 15 te other tests that you've done then i think uh yeah i think that's a that's a that's a good deal that's a that's a big deal now here's the thing when i say fruity notes that you're gonna have so i'm talking about some nice juicy notes here so uh, blended with the the uh, with the vanilla here it's the two notes the two fruity notes that i can uh, i would like to point here to my people is 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 the peach i think apricot and i think mango <sighs> this is good this is this is now here's the thing there's another scent out there so obviously, since we're talking about fruity notes, it has a mango note. It has a good, sweet mango note, which nothing wrong with that. Absolutely gorgeous, fine. But since I was testing there for like a couple of, you know, I was there for a couple of minutes, almost an hour, I would say. After a while, I was like, I was done with that mango scent like i was thinking i was asking to myself like would i want to wear this for like next eight hours i mean mango is fine it looks premium it's exclusive it's it's excellent i mean nothing wrong with that but is that something that you want to sniff for eight hours like <laughs> i mean that's that's uh, i mean to me it was not just feeling right if you know what i mean um here's the thing I don't mind fruity notes and no one does actually it's it's beautiful and unless it's done in a in a great way the fruity notes that i want to be for myself or for i mean for anyone is is to be lighter more kind of like a airy fruity notes not too dense or not too deep or not too much in your face or on your nose or getting you know all the way to your head so it has to be light, it has to be, uh, the point is, has to be aromatic. It's, it's, it's in the end of the day, you gotta be enjoying that thing, right? Um, so yeah, so good amount of fruity notes. As I said, I get a bit of a apricot, peachy kind of a vibe here. And a slight mango touches at the same time. Beautiful, excellent. In the mids, nice amount of woods kick in. It's 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 just surprising to see the transitional quality of this guy from fruity to leaning on the dark side now so it's 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 getting heavier it's getting denser more um a bit iris kicks in uh, the creaminess is just like a touch of creaminess it's not a creamy scent in the end of the day uh, but that's there but that mixes up with the woods a bit of a tobacco kicks in a bit of a rum kicks in after the mid notes it's just so nutty i would say at the same time which makes again i mean the part of my review and the excitement for this is which i'm actually now coming is it makes it so interesting and so deep um there's a depth to to the juice you get to get that nutty that nuttiness um I, I i don't think i'm gonna be wrong if i say that chest nutty kind of a note that it turns into so it, it's no longer fruity uh kind of like a pop that how it opened or how it was for or remained for an hour or two it's like a totally different scent that you're wearing and now here's what it is and actually in the end of the day after like three hours or so leans or takes a path of stronger review absolutely so it actually yeah i mean not as intense as this to be honest 
but I would say 70 to 75 percent or maybe 80 percent like like let's give it a leeway of 70 to 80 percent it turns into I mean to my nose that's what I actually um felt as if I'm wearing strong with you absolutely and and more power to this I mean there's nothing wrong in that I mean we are waiting for good colognes or inspirations of, of scents by I mean whoever especially these Middle Eastern brands to come up who can actually you know um, get closer to you know to the to the to the OGs I mean not only the OGs I mean these these are like the legends you know the OG legends like you know we need the stuff getting closer to to the you know, huge designer wares and like especially the top-notch ones and strong with the absolute is absolutely an amazing center there's absolutely no doubt no thoughts about this this thing it's rare it's dis discontinued people are just you know still yet crazy and then you know we all crave to have this in our collection even a backup bottle um, but if we can find this, I mean, obviously, if all the inspirations are like totally welcome, as long as they're doing a good job and justifying their juice quality and you know, giving us, us, us some good um, sprays, actually. So, yes, I am um, pretty happy, very satisfied with this, with this scent. Good stuff here. Again, for that transition from that sweet tropical juicy fruity powdery a bit powdery a bit creamy to woody dense tobacco-ish a bit boozy-ish um sweet powdery like warm spicy and, and nutty in the end of the day what else do you want temperature wise season wise all four seasons absolutely this is not too heavy not too light this is not too sweet not a freshy at the same time good balanced scent anyone can kill this as i said young mature um even ladies if if you can try it why not and uh uh again this gives a longevity of about seven to eight hours easily it just it leans on to the next day in the end of the day to be honest like it it will cover your full day um i, I did what like five five sprays every every day and i was like you know pretty much completing my day without any issue again good bottle good presentation i just wanted to put the word out there um i like what this does and uh yeah keep coming more latafa and keep uh, you know what surprising us take care guys subscribe and i'll see you in the next one